Where to? Wherever Templar affairs lead us. Liam, it's not like you to set out without a plan. Plan or no plan, we choose our own battlefield. And hey, we're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right you are. Let's set sail. Sir Keeley's tasked you with this mission. No. He tasked me to task you. We need to find what was stolen from Mac and Dalshay. You have to recover the precursor box of manuscript. This is your mission. But what's yours? To you watch your arse. Achilles doesn't really trust me, does he? Give it time, Shay. Do this for him. For us. And you'll do much more than earn his trust. Liam, do you know what Achilles writes about? I see him in his office all the time, bent over his papers. He keeps records and accounts, studies what little is known about the pieces of Eden. And of course, he corresponds with assassins on other continents. Of course. Liam, you could be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as you. I cannot help if Achilles wants me to be familiar with our counterparts in Europe and elsewhere. Said like his favorite son. Connor's his favorite and only son. Then Achilles is heir. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. You call me that again. I'll throw you in the ocean. Some rum shot till he bells calls him out. <laughs> then he'll raise hands high and loud. He'll cry, Thank Christ, I'm homeward now. <laughs> when his money's all gone, it's the same old song. Get up, Jack Johnson now. Come along, come along. Only the great boys and the lady more frog in the jar. With now the briny ocean like a jolly roving star. Come along, come along. Me jolly brave boys and the lady more frog in the jar. Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the tongue in France. Ah, the cabbage farmer has returned. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'd be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it, imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our allies has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship. How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers, Shay. When the time comes, they will lend aid and help us fight the Templars. If only the roast beef would realize the Templars were pulling their strings. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we're meeting? You need not worry about Le Chasseur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and English fleets. And he knows more about what goes on in these parts than you can ever hope to learn. So, Liam, what can you tell me about Adewale? You obviously admire the man. 
I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who'd done so much for our cause. It's much more than that. Adi Wale was already a legend before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate. The scourge of the West Indies. Robbing... ...elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Woods Rogers and Calico Jack Rackham. There, Captain. An English vessel. And she looks to be in trouble. That's fine indeed. Perhaps we should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. Let's not be too hasty. She's got a brown cargo. Take a look for your spyglass and see for yourself. It's exciting. We say this is a good day to light in King George's pockets. Be careful. A few shots should be enough to cripple her. Too much damage and she'll go down with all souls. And all spoils. We can board and loot her before the crew knows what hit them. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the Morgan before going any further. There's a harbour master stationed nearby. Spend our new wealth on improvements. Oh, I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes. Francois McCandle is their mentor. He gathers many of his assassins from the Maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. The shame, though. He escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in an earthquake. But... Haiti's a French colony, that. Eh? Aye, it is. And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French own the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Small fishing village. Is this the place? It's nothing but fishermen and their gear. Aye, per se and fishing go hand in hand. But it will serve our purposes well enough. The French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. You'd better borrow some coin. A barter with an empty purse won't get you very far.
What's on your mind, Captain? I'm a bit of business, that. Please accept my most sincere thanks. Indeed. The chasseur is waiting for us. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. Morrigan seems sturdy enough for the challenge. Ships ahoy! More fishermen from Perse. Ships. They're sinking the fishing boats. You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. These cowards must pay. And would you look at that? That is right in our way, Pat and Crossy. What say you? you? Sink every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. Short sail! Get off the squall! For sail! For sail! Who's down? Man your sinks! Yards off the wind. Go! 
and let us go on. Not too far from that past line now. Will your friend the spy be waiting for us? Yes. I hope the chasseur has more information than the manuscript. Maybe he'll have the whole thing figured out for us. And maybe I'm Emperor of Rome. Ave Caesar! Salt air, open skies, a man out on the ocean is as free as a man can be. What do you say, Liam? We're out here for a reason, Shay. Mind your duty. But what's the point of freedom if you cannot breathe deep and enjoy it? The Templars stick to this continent like tar. They won't feel liberated until we pry them off. Seems to me we should just talk to them like men instead of skulking around. And would you smile and wish them a good day as they lay their boot on your neck? There it is. Anticristi. The chasseur should be there. And with any luck, he will know where to find that manuscript. Unfurl, mates! Let's move! Stop! Bring it all in! Loose and cuts the wind! Great for it! Fucking on it! Fall down and it flew up! Loose made sails! Anticosti Island. Go on ahead, Shay. We will meet you at the fort. Take a look at this. I borrowed these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Shea Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you seek. It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings, plants, and animals out of an opium dream. Were there no charts? No, no, no maps? No. There may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the roast beefs could ken Where's the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington sent him. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay. It's your turn to find him. You, sir, have our thanks. <laughs> 